Welcome to the discussion on C++ default function arguments. A function can be defined with zero or more arguments that can be passed to it when the function is called by another part of the program. For example, the square root function has one argument, the value on which the square root is to be computed. When square root is called, it is passed a parameter. For example, Square root 25.0 computes the square root of 25 and returns a 5.0. When you write your own functions, you can choose how many arguments the function has and if any of the arguments can have default values. The default value is used if not all the parameters are supplied when the function is called. Default arguments are provided for C and D. Therefore, the sum function can be called with two, three, or four parameters. The first two arguments do not have default parameters and must be supplied. Arguments are defaulted from right to left, which means that the D argument can't be supplied and C is. The first example line shows two parameters are being supplied. Then argument C and D get their default values of zero. The second example shows three parameters are supplied. The last parameter, D, gets the default value of zero. All four parameters are supplied in the last example. Default values can be any legal value for the data type of the argument. The values for C and D do not need to be zeros. They can be any value for any integer. Since this example has a prototype for the display city function at the top of the code and the code for the function itself is below main, the default arguments are provided in the prototype. Here is another thing to notice. In order to use C++ strings, the include statement pound include string is needed. Because the function prototype for the display city function has arguments of type string, the pound include string must be placed before the function prototype. This example shows that the function named display city has three arguments, city, state, and country. Default arguments are provided for state and country, but not city. This means that the city must be supplied. When calling the function, arguments can be skipped going from right to left. Both state and country can be skipped, but an error will be generated by the compiler if city and country are defined, but not the state. The first example shows only the city Jackson is supplied. Therefore, the display shows Jackson, California, USA, because state and country use the default arguments specified in the prototype. The output from the second example shows Jackson, Mississippi, USA. The USA is provided by the default argument. In the fourth and fifth example, all three parameters are supplied. That pretty much wraps up default arguments for functions in C++. See you around next time.